Securing Our Borders, a Crucial Shield Against Terrorism. Hi neighbors, my name is Peter Boykin and I am running to be your next Lieutenant Governor. Please check out my website at peterboykin.com. Thank you for going right with Peter Boykin. Hi folks, my name is Peter Boykin and I'm running for Lieutenant Governor of North Carolina. Please check out my website at peterboykin.com. You can learn a little bit more about me and check out speeches like this. Today I want to talk about securing our borders, a crucial shield against terrorism. In the ever-evolving global landscape, the resurgence of terrorist groups like Hamas raises red flags reminding us of the critical need to prioritize the protection of our southern border. The parallels with Israel's struggles, particularly their own 9-11 level attack, serve as a stark reminder that terrorism is a threat that transcends borders. As a nation, the imperative is clear. We must put America first while steadfastly looking out for our allies, including Israel. The concern amplifies when we consider the delicate balance between exercising our First Amendment rights and the potential misuse that can lead to supporting terrorism. The recent surge in protests, often leaning towards favoring Palestine over Israel, warrants a close examination. While the First Amendment grants us the freedom of speech and expression, it does not provide a license to pull a metaphorical fire alarm in a crowded room, instigating chaos and harm. Our constitutional rights should be wielded responsibly, and the line between peaceful protests for positive change and activities that incite hatred and violence must be discerned. The history of protest in our country has been a catalyst for positive societal shifts, and it is paramount that we safeguard this legacy. As a candidate for the position of Lieutenant Governor in the 2024 election, I am committed to navigating the delicate balance between upholding constitutional rights and recognizing when boundaries have been breached. Our nation cannot afford to become as volatile as others have witnessed, with protests leading to desecrations and societal breakdowns. The words spoken in the past by Donald Trump resonate with the urgency of the situation now. His call in the past for bans on immigrants from countries harboring known terrorist groups reflects a proactive approach to national security. Perhaps it is time to reconsider and reinforce policies that prioritize the safety and well-being of all American citizens. Currently, the leadership in place appears to be inadvertently causing more harm than healing. If elected as Lieutenant Governor, I pledge to work towards a government that knows its place, one that protects constitutional rights, while taking decisive action when the well-being of our nation is at stake. Together, let us build a future where America and North Carolina stand strong and united against the threats that seek to divide and destabilize us. All votes matter. More than ever before in the election of 2024, all votes do matter. Please check out peterboykin.com for more information.